What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's Saray Karen and for the past week and a half everyone in the tech community has been talking about the iPhone 13 and I feel like hey guys slow down. We haven't even had the iPhone 12 Pro for that long. So in today's video I'm going to talk about my top three favorite features of the iPhone 12 Pro and why we shouldn't be talking about the iPhone 13 just yet because this phone is still worth all of our attention. Let's get to the video. Jumping right into the video guys, I'm going to start with my number three favorite thing about my iPhone 12 Pro and that is going to be iOS 14. Now I know a lot of you guys can relate because just about anyone with an iPhone right now should be running iOS 14 and paired with the A14 Bionic chip for the processor, it makes the iPhone 12 Pro all that more amazing when you're using it. Some of my favorite features of iOS 14, it's just going to be the customization features. I remember back when I made that making our iPhone aesthetic videos, I really just tapped the surface of everything that you can do with iOS 14 when it comes to customization. But as I've been using my phone, I want to say for about six months or so, give or take, from changes to the mail app to being able to use themes and widgets, there are so many things that iOS 14 brought to us with the iPhone 12 Pro. And I feel like just when you use software on a day-to-day, -day, take that software for granted. But before iOS 14, I know that there was a host of things that we weren't able to do that we can on our iPhone 12 Pros now. And I really, really, really love iOS 14 because it makes me creating these videos, getting on this channel, interacting with you guys all that more easier, whether it's multitasking, being able to customize your messages and pin the people that you talk to the most up at the top, just little menial tasks like that, that iOS 14 provides in your iPhone 12 Pro. It's just something that I really, really appreciate. And I feel like a lot of people really really don't give it enough credit and the software is really what makes the phone. So that is my number three thing that I really love about my iPhone 12 Pro. Coming in at number two, you guys, is going to be the processor. And I put the processor as number two because I felt like it was a great segue from iOS 14 because the processor is a chip that allows your phone to run so smoothly with that iOS 14 software. And a lot of people don't know your processor, especially this A14 Bionic chip, allows us to load apps faster, allows us to load games faster, allows you to multitask on your phone and it be smooth. It's just like these little things that a lot of people take for granted in the phone. Uh, those are the type of things that I really appreciate. Leave a comment down below and let me know if you guys have an iPhone 12 Pro or iPhone 12 Pro Max, how many apps do you guys open? How many things are you multitasking with that you really don't even think about? And it's all due to the processor in the phone. And that's why it came in at number two on this list of things that I love about my iPhone 12 Pro. Coming in at number one on my list of things that I love about my phone, the iPhone 12 Pro, it's gonna be the build and the body of of this iPhone. And I want to specify that I'm not necessarily talking about the design. I'm really talking about the durability of the phone on the front and the back. And that is something that is so amazing. With this model of the iPhone, Apple introduced something called ceramic shield display glass. It's nano ceramic crystals that are transparent. And that's basically just a very, very, very durable material. And I can attest to that because if you guys are familiar with this channel, I recently broke my iPhone 12. This is a replacement model of my previous iPhone 12 Pro. And it was ran over by a car. And I do have to say it was in one of the silicone MagSafe cases from Apple. But if you guys are familiar with those cases, Cases, you know that they don't provide that much protection. I really use it for the aesthetics, but while riding my Super 73, my phone fell out of my pocket and it was ran over by a car, but the phone still worked. The back glass was broken, but the front screen completely fine. It was shattered on the back, but there wasn't significant damage that my phone wasn't working. And that is very, very, very surprising. So these phones are getting more and more and more durable. And I don't think enough people talk about 
how durable this iPhone 12 Pro really is. With this phone being so durable, and I'm sure Apple making the next generation model more and more durable, it's gonna lead to a lot of people upgrading less and less, and that is why that's my number one favorite feature about this iPhone, because the less money that you guys have to spend on upgrading your phones because they're technically not breaking anymore, I wanna say that is a win in my book. So we are at the end of the video, guys, and if you made it all the way to the end, I wanna say a big thank you. Uh, definitely go ahead and leave a like on this video. It really helps out the channel. It helps promote us. It helps more people find us and become a part of the SKS squad. So definitely drop a like and don't forget to comment. What is your favorite thing about your iPhone 12 or your iPhone 12 Pro Max? And don't forget to subscribe. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.